through the legs, drawing shoulder blades back, lengthening the entire body. Then slowly bringing our left knee across to the right arm and coming down into Ikapada Kapatasana Pigeon Pose. Head to arms, just relax here for a moment. And you've got all your body weight over the right hip. And you're not relaxed too much on the left side of the body. Nice and centered. Breathe the body and just enjoy the stretch. Drawing the arms out as long as you can in front of you. Relax the head to the ground and just breathe the body. Allow the body to relax, melt into the ground, release any tension. On the exhale, always release the tension. Slowly bring your arms up together. Lengthen all the way through and just lift the chest, allowing yourself to have a nice stretch of the spine. Bending the arms if you can't come quite as high. Just really feeling and scanning how the body feels. If you feel you can go a little higher, draw the arms back. Push back and then relax the head. Slowly drawing the head forward. We're now going to take this leg, the left leg, out a little further to increase the depth of this stretch. Placing your head back down to the arms, breathe the body, take nice big deep breaths. You should really feel a beneficial stretch to the left hip as the right leg is lengthened. Increasing the leg and bringing it forward is going to make a difference to this stretch. You will go much deeper. Allow the arms to lengthen again and just feel the benefits of everything releasing. Again, bring the hands back in just in front of you. Allow the body to sit upright, neutralize the spine, neutralize the legs so that you're not falling on one side more than the other. And then to fingertips and allow yourself to come back as far as you can. Lengthen the neck, breathe the body. We're now going to bring ourselves back into downward facing dog. Lengthen through the shoulders, walking through the feet, chin to chest, bottom to the ceiling. And then really push through. Right knee comes forward and allow the leg to come straight in front of you into pigeon pose. Bringing the hands together, placing the head down on hands and relaxing. Just scanning the body to see how you're feeling. Make sure you're not sitting too far on the right hip and that you want to be squared and centered. Nice deep breathing. Allowing yourself to feel the benefits. Lengthening the body. Lengthening the arms, head to the ground. Breathe the body. Slowly bringing the hands in, allowing yourself to push back. And just adjusting yourself so that you feel comfortable, and that you're getting a nice stretch, lifting up through the chest. If you feel comfortable, draw the hands slightly closer up onto fingertips, lengthen the chest, arch through the back and lengthen the neck, breathe the body. We're now going to adjust our right foot, we're going to slowly bring it out as far as we feel comfortable in front of us. Allow the arms to come out in front of you, relax the head onto the hands. And breathe the body. Adjust if you feel needed. And always scanning and be mindful of what the body is telling you. Lengthen the arms. Do the stretch. Relax. 
relax the mind, relax the breath, relax the body. Slowly bringing the hands back, lengthen through the arms, lifting up through the chest. Breathe the body, and then if you feel comfortable and going a little further, you come back to where you feel comfortable. Lengthen the neck. Slowly pushing yourself back and coming into Balasana, extended arms. Pushing the body right back onto the heels, beautiful stretch through the back, allowing yourself to relax. 